Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at running Odoo, an open source business suite, in Docker. To get started, connect to the device where we're going to install Docker. We'll begin by using apt install to install a few prerequisite packages required to run Docker. Then we'll add the Docker GPG key and apt repository. Next, we'll install Docker, Docker Compose, and Container D. With the Docker packages installed, we'll make sure the Docker service is started and enabled. Add the current user to the Docker group, then re-authenticate the current user for the group change to take effect. We're now ready to start running containers. We'll start by creating working directory structures to store our container data in. Then we'll set ownership and permissions on the new working directories. Now using the docker run command, we'll create our Postgres database container. We'll temporarily start an Odoo container using docker run. Then using the docker cp command, we'll copy the odoo.conf file out of the running container and then remove it. Next, we'll modify the odoo.conf file with our database name. And finally, we'll run our odoo container with docker run. Open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the docker host, colon 8069. Log in with the email and password admin. Click the user icon at the top right of the screen, then select Preferences. Update the email address and signature as needed, then click Save. Navigate back to the user preferences, then select account security. Click change password, then enter admin as the current password. Now enter and confirm a new password and click the change password button. Log back into Odoo with the updated email address and password. Welcome to Odoo, running containerized in Docker.